Hi, I'm Dr. Dan Shapiro. I'm a plastic surgeon certified by the American Board of Plastic Surgery, and I've been practicing plastic surgery uh, uh, in the uh, Scottsdale Paradise Valley area since 1992. All I perform is aesthetic or cosmetic plastic surgery, uh, and, and one of the common things that I do is body contouring surgery, or a tummy tuck. Um, a tummy tuck, as you know, is really two parts of a procedure. The first part is the removal of the extra skin and fat, uh, usually the lower abdomen, and, and pulling all that uh, excess tissue down. Uh, and the, the second part of the procedure is tightening the muscles on the inside. Um, and that involves putting some sutures along the fascia of the muscle to make them uh, much tighter and more shapely. A common question uh, that I have of patients is, can I get pregnant after uh, an abdominoplasty? The answer to your question is yes. Um, an abdominoplasty, as, as I described, will tighten the muscles, but those muscles will relax as, as, as someone is pregnant and, and their belly grows with gestation. Um, and, and after they deliver, uh, you know, we're hoping that uh, um, the tissues will snap back in terms of elasticity uh, and, and uh, resume more of their normal shape. Unfortunately, an abdominoplasty will somewhat undo some of the tightening on the inside uh, where those sutures are placed, but one can't really tell until we see what the result is. It would be like the same kind of prediction after having a breast augmentation uh, and breastfeeding. You really have to see what the result will be. Uh, and in fact, over time, you may want to have a secondary abdominoplasty. I do try to pre-screen people uh, for an abdominoplasty and make sure that they think that they're at the tail end of having children. But if in fact there's a surprise and, and someone finds themselves pregnant again, I don't think it's any need to worry. Uh, and I think that you cross that road uh, um, uh, in the future to see whether or not you feel that you need any further tightening or tissue removal uh, in the future. But the best way to do is to come in for a consultation and get an expert opinion. Thank you very much.